All right, Adriana, thank you. And today's we're open. Rod Burks takes us to a West Allis restaurant featuring seed to table dining. Wild Roots at 6807 West Beecher Street in West Allis just celebrated their two year anniversary. They're a farm to table restaurant that's getting pretty popular because of their delicious food and great ambiance. Everything about this restaurant is very personal to me. Uh, we try to take everything that's here that has some kind of significance, some kind of history. Uh, I try to keep it like um, woodsy, earth tones. T. Kale spent eight years as the head chef at Buckley's restaurant before opening up Wild Roots. Now he's the boss. With 17 years of experience in the kitchen, he's wowed his customers with his dishes. We sear up this burger that we ground in-house, and then we submerge it in duck fat. Having to submerged in the duck fat? One, it's delicious. Uh, Two, cheese. it's uh, something that's kind of like different. That's, that's what we're all about. We, we take something, we could give it a little twist, something different, something wild, and uh, simply done with American cheese, caramelized onions, and our house made uh, Thousand Island. Most of the food that he cooks is wild and natural, with the foundation coming from different farms in the area. So this milky dish, it's a vegetarian dish, made with uh, seasonal um, squash that we get from a farmer, um, fresh peas. The style that we're making though is, um, it's Parisian style gnocchi. We just kind of a butter, uh, eggs, and flour. But we pipe it into a salted ball of boiling water, saute it up, brown butter, sage, uh, walnuts, raisin. It's delicious. It's like the We're Open crew making a special stop here at West Alice at Wild Roots. They have a dynamite menu, and the recommendations here are the duck fat burger and the gnocchi. Here in West Alice, for We're Open, Rod Burks, TMJ4 News.